Hello. Instead of reading to you, I'm going to sing to you Psalm 23. And most of you are very familiar with that. And then we are going to pray through it together as I paraphrase it. So um, I hope you enjoy this. I'm trying to do this outside and hopefully the neighbor dog won't bark. The new 23rd. Because the Lord is my shepherd, I have everything that I need. He lets me rest in meadows green and leads me beside the quiet stream. He keeps on giving life to me and helps me to do what honors Him the most. Even when walking through the dark valley of death, valley of death, I will never be afraid, for He is close beside me, guarding, guiding all the way. He spreads a feast before me in the presence of my enemies. He welcomes me as his special guest with blessing overflowing. His goodness and unfailing kindness shall be with me all of my life and afterwards i will live with him forever forever in his home forever in his home forever in his home so now let's meditatively pray through psalm 23 together thank you lord that you are my shepherd, protecting and guiding me, providing for all my needs. Thank you for restoring my anxious soul. When I seek you in prayer and quiet contemplation, you put your peace in my heart and calm my soul. You keep me on the path of righteousness with the voice of your Holy Spirit. Even though I may walk through dark valleys, with the shadow of death before me, I will not fear what may happen, because you are always with me. I know that your rod and staff are there to keep me from danger and on the correct path for my steps. Even when I feel surrounded by enemies or insur insurmountable obstacles, even there you protect and provide for me. You honor me as a special guest at your house. As we spend time together, you fill my heart with joy. I believe that your goodness, your love and mercy for me will fill every day of my life here on earth. And after this life is over, I will live with you in your heavenly home forever. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you for your word, the truth of your word. Help us, Lord, to remember who you are and who we are in you. We are the beloved. So may you be blessed today and encouraged and strengthened in the Lord. I want to encourage you to meditate on the scriptures, um, even pray through them like we just did. And um, trust in the Lord, even though you may go through dark valleys. God bless you.